so firstly go to file then click on new I want 1000 by 1000 pixel document now fill it with white now I will make a then uh, go to view show then grid I want then click on this rectangle marker tool now take a selection of this two lines now fill it with black control D to deselect now maintain this gap again go to rectangle marker tool take a selection fill it with black black control D now this is the effect this is background and these are the lines okay now press ctrl T now I will move this edge this edge to parallel of this edge right click on there go to distort this starting point is meeting with this point now on the other side match this point to the end of this point now click on ok then go to this rectangle marker tool now take a selection from here very nice now go to edit cut it make a new layer fill it with edit and paste so this is the effect I got now right click on there uh, if you want to go to 3d then new mesh from layer mesh preset now we have this sphere now click on sphere so this is the sphere I got so here my aim is to remove the white points so firstly I will go to a view show then I will remove the grids so this is the 3d view now uh, I am again going to this layer panel now click on this sphere metal double click on there then you will get this make a new file again now move it move this layer to down now fill it with black this is very necessary part so click on this control click on this take a selection now fill it with white so this is the necessary step uh, background should be white and uh, your pattern should be uh, sorry your pattern should be white and background should be black now go to file then save as and make sure you have choose this PSB format so I will save it uh, like mm, sphere I will call it sphere now save it on desktop click on save okay now I'm um, I'm going again to this sphere now go to 3d options uh, go to this sphere metal there are so many options one is opacity now go to this now load texture now select the texture that we have made sphere so this is a texture so as you can see so if I so this is a hello sphere so in this way you can create hello sphere it's really very easy and you can use it uh, on any project so I hope you have liked this video and uh, keep in touch with us thank you friends